I like my camera, so I'll put a ring on it. <laughs> What's up, everybody? Sorry for the corny joke. This is the Voice Mag channel. I'm Patrick, your photo editing guru. I'm sure that corny joke got me at least one new subscriber. Today, I'm going to review a new flash mod that all of my photographer friends are asking me about. This guy right here. This here is a $24 newer universal collapsible ring flash mount. <laughs> this here connects to your existing speed light flash. I'll make sure I have a link in the description. So I've had my failed investments in ring flash, so I was a little skeptical about buying this one. But the reviews on Amazon looked promising, so I was figured out, give it a try. So let's roll intro and jump right into assembly, taking photos and some example shots with this guy right here. So a lot of YouTube channels jump into how to shoot with the ring flash and how to get great photos with your ring flash, but not a lot of YouTubes jump into why use a ring flash. And that's what I wanna to touch on first before we get started. So your ring flash, its goal is to provide even illumination throughout your shot, minimizing shadows. So ring flashes are used a lot with macro photography, portraits, and fashion photography. Now, your traditional ring flash will have lights, around your lens. So it'll have built-in lights around your limbs. Those are a little more expensive. The ones like this one here and the one I just threw on the floor a moment ago, those, those try and take your flash, your existing flash, and distribute it, evenly distribute that flash around your lens, giving you even lighting in your shot. It does that by slightly dulling the light at its source, at the top, and then it amplifies the light around in the circle. You'll see that happen here if you get this you'll be able to see that inside but if you take a look at this one you can kind of see that a little bit better at the light source here it gets dulled a little bit here and then it's illuminated around here or amplified around the lens but don't get this one portrait and fashion photographers love the catch light the circle catch light you see in the models or the subject eyes I'm gonna be focusing on portraits and fashion and not so much macro photography, but ring flashes are very popular in macro photography as well. Assembly can be done very quickly. You simply allow it to unfold after unzipping and removing it from its sleeve. These little bars have magnets that allow them to snap together and expand the softbox. Next, you'll put the camera in place using the proper openings for lens and your speed light. Then you'll use this strap that has Velcro on it to lock your speed light in place. Now you're ready to shoot. It definitely feels a little awkward to hold this, to hand hold this and shoot. And it's also a little awkward to change your focal length. If you're shooting from behind, you have to reach around front and do your zoom like this. I highly recommend using a tripod and for me, it wasn't too much of a hassle when adjusting my focal length while shooting. Take a look at these gorgeous images. You see the catch light in the eyes? That's what makes the ring flash so popular with portrait and fashion photography. Now, issue 50 of Good Light Magazine features a very, very informative magazine about using your ring flash. It even has some cool setups for ring flash by itself or incorporating the ring flash into your existing lighting setup. Now, in the examples I gave you, they were just using a single ring flash to light my subject. No rear lights, just one light. So, essentially, that's a $24 setup, unless you don't have a speed light already. I use a simple one light setup, 50 millimeter lens, and a 1.8 aperture. I stand about five feet away from my model. Pro tip, the closer you are to your model, the bigger the catch light effect in the eyes. I definitely keep my aperture wide open. I shoot at about a 200th of a second and an ISO of 100. Here are some more of the results. I definitely recommend picking up one of these ring flashes. For portraits, it's as essential as a 50 millimeter lens. I hope you found this video useful. 
hit like and subscribe for more videos like this, drop a comment for future topic ideas, and happy shooting.